Hey everyone, Mini Brick Productions here, and today I begin a new type of video. Along with doing full CMF drafts, I'm going to start publishing four figure packs, which though they might seem literally like a Bricktober pack, is a concept of a year round promotion that LEGO could do for random licenses and not just hand them out in October. My first pack is on the new movie Captain Marvel, which premiered this weekend. This video is spoiler free, so for those of you who haven't seen the movie yet, you can still watch this video and be free of spoilers. All figures were drawn using trailer images as well as images from the sets. So without further ado, let's take a look at the figures. The first figure in this pack is the hero herself, Captain Marvel. She comes with a new hairpiece which I made specifically for her, as I don't exactly like LEGO's rendition of her true hairstyle, and I thought she needed to have something that truly captured her look, as she is a vital character in both this movie and will be in Endgame. For those following me on Instagram, which you all should at Mini Brick Minifigs, you may have already seen this figure. However, her printing has been updated to be more accurate and detailed. Her accessory is her pager, which Nick Fury uses to contact her in the end credit scene of Infinity War. Next we have Talos, a scroll from outer space, he is supposedly a bad guy, again, I haven't seen the movie, and seems to be playing a big role in the film. Because I only used reference pictures and trailer images to make this figure pack, Talos doesn't have an accessory as none of the images or trailers showed him holding anything or being referenced to anything. His printing is highly detailed to best capture his look in the movie, which is very rough and full of lines. He also comes with a skirt cloth piece that covers his side and the back of his legs. The next figure is of a younger Nick Fury. He has on his beige suit along with his gold and blue tie. I was originally going to draw him in his black suit, but I decided that it would be much nicer to give him a more casual design and a torso that is more uncommon than a black suit. His face printing shows his scar above his eye, which is shown in almost all of the trailers, as well as outlines for his cheekbones. His hairpiece is Finn's hairpiece from the LEGO Star Wars sets, and his accessory is a simple black handgun. Finally, we have a more relaxed figure, Carol Danvers in her casual outfit. This is the outfit we see in the trailers when she's working alongside Nick Fury. Her hair is covered with her shield hat, which is molded into her hairpiece, and her, her shirt says something along the lines of Nin, though I'm not exactly sure what it means. If you know, let me know in the comments. Her accessory is her cat Goose, which has her collar, unlike LEGO's version, and what I think is a much better color choice than in the set LEGO released. And there we have it! My four Captain Marvel figures and my very first figure pack on this channel! Remember, I still haven't seen the movie, and also wanted to keep this spoiler free for those who haven't seen it. Therefore, I'm sure I must have included some important characters that I have no idea are in the film, so please don't point out that I'm missing so and so in the comments. Furthermore, even though this pack has only 4 figures, I will still definitely draw more figures from the movie eventually, which will most likely be posted on my Instagram, at minifigs, which you all should go follow. Let me know what you guys think about this figure pack in the comments below, leave me some suggestions for future CMF drafts or figure packs, and subscribe! See you guys later!